How's Donna? Potential bleeding issues. Dire issues? Significance is the word they used, but dire is good. How's Donna? Some issues. Life-threatening? Significant. Hey, Donna okay? Some issues. I'm not sure what they you are. You know what, maybe we'll do this all at once. Josh? I can't. Any news on Donna? Some issues. Potentially significant. With bleeding. Anyway, there's been major blood loss. Poor kid. What's going to be our response? What do you think it should be? Regime change. Take out the chairman. He is the impediment. The Palestinians never miss an opportunity to miss an opportunity. I'll bet you've been lying. The guy in Tel Aviv's no picnic either. State's convinced nothing can happen until these two guys are gone. Israel's not the problem. The settlements, the wall. Israel needs to blow Americans up. I'm not saying there's equivalence. Israelis don't talk about driving the Palestinians into the sea. Some do. Oh, come on. You've never heard the phrase greater Israel? Not from anyone serious. One reason people say nothing can happen until these guys are gone is the feeling they both may be stuck in old attitudes or assumptions. And there was a time when Palestinians and all Arabs wanted to drive Jews into the sea. But some would argue that time's passed. Listen to some Arab broadcasts. Rabble rousing to distract their street. I'm not sure any credible Arab leader truly expects Israel's demise anymore. I mean, not even the chairman. Don't bet on it. Oh, well, there's a view that... Don't keep saying some argue and there's a view. Can we restrict it to your view? Okay. Palestinians are no longer fighting to destroy the Jewish state. They're fighting for a state of their own. A revolutionary struggle against an occupying force. And revolutionaries will outlast and outdie occupiers every time. I don't know if that's more simplistic or naive. It's tribal. It can't be solved. It's Hatfield and McCoy, and there is no end. We have to retaliate. Responding militarily makes us a combatant. When they attack your people, they've pretty much made that choice for you. Well, we use this as an opportunity. Employ the moral authority to re-engage in aggressively pressing both sides for peace. We need to kill them. We need to find them and to kill them. We kill them. Then we find out who sent them, and we kill them too. Josh? You kill the people who did it, you kill the people who planned it, then you kill everyone who was happy about it. 